is G off key. Very, very funny because G is actually a musical note. Okay, let's do this. Get some some new outfits. Okay, we're headed into the music room. We better rock this look. Ha, <laughs> that's a good one. You look great. Let's go. All right, let's do this level. Was that Tyler heading into the room over there? Let's go talk to him. I have some questions for him, but let's investigate this room first. Perfect, some more uh, objects to find. The first one is a little apple, the, right in the middle left there. After that, we've got uh, some more grain and hay, right below the chair. Next, we've got a drum, an orange drum. I'm not gonna try and tell you the name of the drum because I couldn't tell you. Uh, next, we've got a little bunny playing a harp sticker on the box over here. After that, we got a trumpet right here. Next, we have a music note. We gotta just move the screen up a little bit and it's on the top banner up there. Next, we have a little tablet on the middle left and some sort of red covering on the piano bench. Excellent. We'll match these up again. Could this be the source of the hay and grain in the gym? A very suspicious message from Jack. Ugh, sticky. Suspicious. <laughs> New suspect, Tyler Wright. Okay. Take the hammer to it. That's what Jack wrote to Tyler in the email we found. This definitely sounds suspicious. More than suspicious, in fact. Well, since Jack wasn't very helpful, maybe Tyler will sing a new tune and give us a clue. Yeah, I saw him head into the storage room. Let's go. Into the storage room we go. I'm telling you, G is going to ruin me. Look. Don't panic. It's on the paper I gave you. Ah, oh, okay. Hi, Tyler. Is that Jack you're talking to? Huh? What? What? Who are you? What? I'm Nancy Drew. This is Bess and George, and we're from River Heights Elementary School. Tyler, what is this G that you guys are talking about? Hmm? G? G? Uh, what's that? I have to get to the band room. Excuse me. Let's investigate. Excellent, here we go. Uh, some more silhouetted objects. The first one is a hammer. Right to the right here. The next one we need to find is this weird... I don't even know, I don't even know what that is just by looking at the silhouette. But I can tell you uh, just by... Oh, excuse me. Excuse me as I say that because I can actually say that because doesn't make sense why well, I would say it. It is right here. Just some scrunched up paper, quick and easy. Next we've got a bit of a gear or a clue, it looks like a cipher wheel right here. After that we've got a butterfly. If we look for butterflies, there's only two and the big one we need is right there. After that we've got a monkey wrench. Chimpanzee that. Next we need to find these clippers, I guess, maybe? After that we've got to find like a, a rock on symbol on the guitar. And after that we need to find a hat. would destroy a project. Jack's note to Tyler. What are they trying to pry open? Tools can build and they can take apart. Cool, all right. Come on, let's follow Tyler and investigate the band room. Excellent, level four. What could it mean? Left G in the band room? Huh. We're thinking G equals Gustav, but maybe G is something else. Let's look for clues. Okay, again, some more silhouetted objects. The first one we need to find is a guitar. And this guitar, I believe, is this one right here. Next, we've got some sort of electrical thing right there. After that, we've got a really funky looking shape. Again, I'm not, oh, that's not it. 
Apparently I was uh, clicking on the wrong object. It's actually this one down here. I'm not quite sure what that is, or what it was. After that we got a broken circuit board here, and next another monkey wrench, chimpanzee that once again. After that we have a, a long like baton looking thing right on the ground here. After that we've got a cowbell. You guys ever seen that sketch? Yeah, you need more cowbell. Go look it up, trust me, you will be thanking me later. Put that right there. And finally, we have what looks... I'm not sure what that object is, actually. I believe... Oh, it's this one right here. There we go. And let's match these up. Who's measuring electricity? Did someone destroy this circuit board? A smaller wrench. Could this be the G? All right, there we go. I love music. But I don't understand this tune at all. Hmm, this is confusing. Let's have another chat with Tyler. Looks like he's just outside in the hallway. Perfect, and the last mission for, uh, the last level, I guess, for this chapter that involves hidden objects. Tyler, what are these tools for? Were you working on taking something apart? Uh, uh, no, um, I'm putting something together, actually. Uh, Jack and I have been working on this floor keyboard all year. Uh, when you step on it, it, it plays. Oh, wow, so this is your tech project? Uh, yeah, <laughs> what did you think it was? But it's, uh, not working yet, and now it looks like I'm missing some pieces. Let's see if we can help you find your missing pieces. Okay, here we go. Now we actually have visuals for what we're looking for. The first one is a little doggy bone. Right there, doggy biscuit thing. After that, we've got a round thing. <laughs> I don't know what most of these are called. Uh, and then we got a box with a light bulb in it. After that, we've got some uh, bulletin board tacks, I guess. Uh, thumb tacks, maybe. Right there. Next, we've got a little piece of a marching band outfit right here. After that, we got a little green hedgehog just chilling out on the drum. Next, we have a symbol right behind something back there. And finally, we have this... Oh, oh that's a part of the, um, the Gustav project right there. Couldn't quite tell what it was. Let's match these up. This is a unique piece. What part of the project is this? Found another part. Excellent. We found Tyler's missing pieces. But the keys are still sticky. Woo, yeah! Let's program our puppy to fix the key and play us a song. All right. Lady robot puppy coding level. Use the power command the keys and match that pattern all right so what we're going to do for this one is we're going to go forward we're going to add a loop here we're going to put the jump up loop onto here so we can get the star and we're going to make this uh go two times we're going to add another loop put the forward uh, command in there and make that go three times and then we're going to go power on after that we're going to press forward jump up power on once again and finally forward all right let's clear the queue and we'll add another power on action I'm gonna put the loop in here put forward in and we're gonna loop that twice I'm gonna press power on once more and then jump up forward and finally power on Well done. Okay, cool. Three stars once again, as usual. More sugar cubes. What's up with that? Well, I mean, we have horses on the property. <laughs> I like to feed them sugar cubes. Tyler, I think it was sugar and water that caused your keys to stick. It was all over the gym floor today, and now I see it here under your keyboard. Sugar cubes. Horses. We need to get to the stables. 